right, we're checking out the only game where everyone's favorite juice is human blood. It's Blend It 3D. Anytime I see a game and it actually has like a hand blend meter, I feel really happy. Now, as you can see, you can blend completely normally. Right there is a nice piece of corn. We'll give it this glass here. And then, uh, oh, I don't I don't know why I can cast a magic spell at it. That's kind of odd. Oh, he wants flaming corn. Well, I've messed that up. Might as well keep the failures going. Lightning corn. And you get this spaceship. Oh, I have to place the spaceship perfectly. What happens if I just put it in the middle of the drink, like right here? Does it taste okay? I mean, he seems happy enough. How was my skill at making this all the way perfect? Perfect. Best prize. Oh, I can get a full parrot. Well, this one jumped first, so I'm gonna open it. I feel like I was lied to. Spin the wheel. One of the things you can win is just a random cucumber. Great. If I win the random cucumber, I'm going to feel so happy and at the same time so disappointed. Oh, random orange. The mega lucky wheel. What is this, like a 4,000 horsepower blender? I want it. And the lucky wheel says, come on, 10,000 horsepower blender. 10,000 horsepower blender. 10,000 horsepower blender! What is this? I don't remember what the first thing was. I can blend a cell phone? He drinks cell phones? Okay. What is this, like a Nokia from 1998? So anyway, if you do go down all the way... Welcome to the world's worst paper cut. For some reason, that ruins the beverage. This is a robot, possibly from Skynet. I don't understand why he would not want to dine on human blood. All right, Nokia. Man, this thing is tough. And stop. Okay. That was a perfect. So you get percentages based upon how well you blend. Great. 97%. All right, Nokia number two. Here we go. We don't have enough lithium batteries inside of this drink yet. I feel like if you did drink this, it wouldn't just be like a minor injury. You would probably die from it. All right, you get the Moscow mule glass and we'll throw some lightning into it. We're going to do this perfectly. Cream phone. That's the name of the drink I'm serving. <laughs> All right. So how about the perfect probing? Probe, perfect probe. And now the, uh, I guess, not interested in human blood robot is happy. And now you can see he loves juice, even though two thirds of what he's drinking is actually just battery acid. All right, bird. I want a bird. Oh, I got a glass. Hey. All right, the time has come to what? I thought I owned a shop, like on the beach. It's like an AI program. This is the smallest plot of land I could have been given. Is this like my piece from the government? $900 for this. Yeah, why not? Have coffee. I don't know. I mean, maybe? Yeah, I can make coffee. I mean, all you do is just like punch the beans until they liquefy, right? Custom items. Custom. Custom what? Oh, I got a swift blender. There's a marvelous blender. What does that even mean? <laughs> okay, real quick. The hands are normies, hipsters, jacks, masterminds, and mo where do they come up with it? <laughs> All right, yeah, let's go ahead and make some coffee here. Now, all you really have to do, I really don't know what to do. I guess I just hold on to this. And there's our perfect coffee grind. I'm gonna go ahead and throw some aviation gas in there. Mmm, perfect. Oh, it actually was perfect. Throw some coffee art by vomiting milk into the coffee. Oh, I actually have to draw this like me physically? Gray still plays? I can't draw, wait a minute. Oh, I should have drawn yeet way at the beginning. I had no idea that I could actually yeet a coffee. Now, you don't want to go outside the lines here. I'm just kidding. I do whatever I want. I'm done. How does it taste? It's probably like terrible. Oh, never mind. It tastes perfect. I love juice. No, you don't. You're lying. You don't love juice. You ordered a coffee. Also notice my coffee heart is like twice the size of this sad coffee heart. Doc from Back to the Future is one of my people in line. Oh, we're making a chocolate shake, but we're not adding milk or anything. We're just literally blending down a 12 foot long chocolate bar. Extra, extra large chocolate. Luckily I got this glass and we'll throw some magic at it. Don't ask me why. And there you go. Congratulations. You now have cancer. He's like, fantastic. Just what I always wanted. I too love juice. Not a juice. Not a juice. That is a chocolate bar that has been abused until it turned from a salad into a liquid. I can get an apple slice. You think I don't know where the apple slice is? Watch this. 
I totally didn't know where the apple slice was. <laughs> Oh, I can get a reward. It's a human hand. <laughs> oh, the human hand has a name. It's Henry. All right, Henry, you better not screw this up. Now, every delicious drink begins with an entire husk of corn, followed up by a banana. This sounds absolutely disgusting. Oh, it won't let me not blend more. Okay, hold on. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I wanted to see if I could get a little bit of human flesh in there as well. Sorry, Henry. All right, just go ahead and chill it by using our Merlin powers because everyone knows that one of the common side jobs of a magician is actually a juice barista. I don't know if the person that works at the juicer is technically a barista, but I kind of make coffee too. I'm like the Renaissance man. Did you just drink that entire thing right in front of me? Actually, have all of you been drinking the entire thing in front of me? Get out of the line. Wow, uh, the prize is a set of cherries inside of a nuclear waste container. I don't know if I want your cherries. Oh, I got a cell phone. It's an ingredient? Are you kidding me? Oh, it's just a better cell phone. I guess already I've been feeding people phones thus far. I hadn't really thought about feeding them a better smartphone, I guess. Can I get like a better, this is like a better shrub? I'd rather have a better place to work. Yeah, 2.4, there we go. Hello, madam, would you like a cell phone? I have to mention real quick in the things that you can blend, we have vegetables, normal, fruit, Normal. Sweets, little little strange. Meats, because we're just blending breasts of chicken. Then we have robot, which Yeti. <laughs> Look at all this. Clowns aren't humans. Why are they their own species? Okay. Oh, that's funny. It's like I could choose between ice cream, ice cream, and ice cream. I guess you're getting the ice cream shake. Only because I didn't cream balls. Don't ask me why that's so funny, but it is. Here's your orange wedge. I don't know why you would put that inside of your vanilla shake, but whatever. Yep, they totally drink it right in front of me. They don't even wait to leave the line. What is this? What is that? Ooh, a new blender. Oh yeah, the Fiesta Volcano, what? All right, get ready, I'm about to Fiesta your volcano. World's longest carrot! Oh, the carrot's actually still, oh, whoa! <laughs> carrot Le Grand. I don't speak any other languages, but I feel like that would translate to the big carrot. All right, cucumber, you're coming home with me. I've waited this entire time for a nice <laughs> cucumber ingredient. Oh yeah, we're getting it! Cucumber ingredient! <laughs> oh, this is interesting. I can get like Dr. Evil's blender or Satan's hand. Come on, Satan's hand. Satan's hand. Satan! Satan's hand! I'm really good at calling these things, Dr. Juice. You know what's really scary? Because this is a Google Play Store game. It's totally possible that the game does hear what I'm saying. Ah, clearly you would like a moldy carrot that would give you sepsis. That's fantastic. There we go. Then we're going to go ahead and give you this brand new cucumber that is filled with rabies. There we are. And now it's an entire hot dog. It's just a hot dog. And there's someone's wiener. Wants it in the mule glass with a butter, a living butterfly. Just chill it out on the glass. Just sit there, buddy. I'm sure you won't become part of this beverage. Oh, he didn't. I love juice. The other thing he loves is food poisoning. I just got a hot pepper. I mean, I guess I'll get more tables. I don't even know what having more tables does. Does it give me more people to come to my place? Can I eventually, you know, move out of the 10 by 10 cubicle that you put me in? Oh, we're making coffee. Alrighty. Just gotta backhand the beans, throw it over here into the brewer, grab the cup, and now today, finally, I get to draw my yeet. I had been so distraught. All right, let's see here. All right, oh, 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 come over here, come over here. All over here, here we go. Why? Oh no, it's, it's kind of moving on me. I never thought that coffee art oh, would be so difficult. Oh no, the Yi, it's, it's, it's expanding. This is the ugliest coffee art that any barista has ever made in the history of baristas. You know what? I guess in hindsight, I probably should have just tried an easier word. I'm done. It's good enough. The game won't even let me click done. It was like, no, great. Do not let her drink that. Coffee art. It's not juice. All right, what sort of stupid thing do you want to drink? Ah. Oh, I can give you the I can give you the evil cucumber now. Fantastic. Uh, yeah, you're getting all this just because I can do it. I love that it's just sludge. They don't even have colors. It's just liquid sadness. Oh, well, here it kind of has a color. Summer jam. And there we go. And watch this. Perfect. Congratulations. You now have lymphoma. 
How do you like it? Oh, he's vomiting. <laughs> I love that he still says I love juice. Oh, he's still vomiting. How how long is the how long is the the vomithon gonna go for? You still gonna you gonna try some more? You got anything left in yet? Nope, he's all out. This is good though because technically now he has room to buy another drink. See, I planned it this way. So if I make this perfectly, I get a free hat. <laughs> What does what does it do? I don't actually ever get to see my character. I don't, I'm not I'm not even sure I need a hat. I mean, I'll take it because I can get it, but I don't really know what it does. All right, we'll we'll do the the non feces infused cucumber. How about that? It's a very colorful drink. Bonsai. Alrighty, throw some unicorn urine on there. There you go. And now put the little tiny decoration, which will probably eventually get caught in someone's windpipe and they'll sue me for it. I'm actually surprised that has never happened before. Actually, you know what? It probably has. All right, I can get a watermelon. Here we go. We're getting the watermelon. Right there, big watermelon. I was totally wrong. I got a new glass. Sup, Miley? I hope you don't want watermelon in your drink because I don't have any. Oh, you, you actually want a hot dog blended up along with some corn. That is the most- Wow, that's a lot of hot dogs! This is the most disgusting drink ever! Why? Oh, it's a corn dog! Oh, it's still awful. That's still disgusting. I don't care if that was a somewhat witty way to describe that drink. I still don't think it looks good. All right, let's increase this random tree over here. Oh, it increased all the trees! I like how all the trees just grow up together. Oh, we have a witch. I don't think I've served a witch yet. I find it quite interesting that witches are a completely different type of human being than anyone else, just like wizards. Does that mean like if you killed a wizard, you wouldn't go to jail? Because technically it's not homicide since they're not even considered people. There we go. Out of every single thing I could put in this drink, you want the most boring possible umbrella. You got it. You're gonna stab the girl next to you with it, aren't you? Oh, I'm glad that you brought your glasses from 1988. I remember when these were big. Ah, we can get such great things as a rose or what looks like a chocolate bar made of gold. I think I kind of want the rose. I've never blended up just a plant for someone to eat yet, and I seem to be really good at calling what I want. I get three spins? Well, I might get the rose. Hey, I got a pineapple. Give me my rose. Oh, I got the white chocolate bar. I thought it was golden, but I guess not. Finally, I got my rose. So in the end, I did get what I want. <laughs> All right, what sort of atrocity do you want? Oh, right over here. Got this nice pineapple. I like that we're not using the meat of the pineapple or anything, but we're just grinding up the entire pineapple, including the pineapple outside. In case you're wondering why it's called Morning Rush, I put a bunch of gasoline in this. I'm sure she can, she'll be fine. See, she's totally fine. She gives it three stars. All categories, maxed out. Make sure to leave me a review on Google. All right, witch lady, what do you want? Your last order of the day, so it better not be something insane. Oh, you're the one that eats, like, plants. Just solid, uh, looks like blood. That looked like human blood. And I know what human blood looks like because I've already served it to someone. Oh, which is like white chocolate. That's nice. I like dark chocolate myself, but whatever. Whatever floats your boat. Mystery wild. Okay. I got like an entire butterfly collection that I'm just feeding to people. This is so odd. I never thought these things would go well with a with a drink before. The best prize is a literal spider. I got a shoe. <laughs> it's an ingredient. It's just a shoe. I can't wait to use this shoe. All right, who wants to drink my Converse? Tell me it's you. Oh, it's chocolate and pineapple. That actually sounds like a pretty good drink. The brain booster. What if you don't have any brains to boost? All right, well, there you go. I'm kind of thinking maybe this robot eats human shoes. That'd be great. Jordan. I tried to draw this coffee, like art moon over here, and it kind of got a little bit of a bleeder on the top and the bottom. But, you know, other than that, it's not too bad. Because my coffee art suffered a laceration on the top of my moon, you gave me like a, a three out of four. Are you kidding me? This is a horrible hand to win. I'm so glad that I'm grinding a shoe for a drink. This is the best day of my of my juice bar owning life. You can also have the brand new cell phone here, the hottest cell phone. Lace indestructibles? If it was the Nokia, I would I would believe that. But this is just like a normal cell phone. Normal cell phones actually can break sadly. How do you feel? It'd be amazing if he just exploded. I'm waiting for my juice to kill a human being. I feel like I've already won this. Chocolate. Okay. Chocolate, okay, and here you go, liquid diabetes. You can have this hot pepper. 
but I'm gonna put it in there perfectly. <laughs> How's that make you feel? You happy? What? How? I gave him the wrong decoration and the wrong glass, and he still gives me full stuff. This guy has no standards. I like customers like you. You better not have standards either, lady. You can grind up a roll of toilet paper. I have to get it. Give me the toilet paper, please. I'm spinning until I get it. No, oh wait. Oh no, it won't let me spin again. Here's your pear. I could care less. If I'm not grinding up toilet paper, it's not good enough. Here's a rose too. You can eat the thorns. I hope you choke on them. There, rose pear cider. You got 3% of my effort. You're welcome. Boom. Oh, you stole the bride's tracksuit from Kill Bill. I appreciate that. What would you like? Corny banana. I keep saying that sounds disgusting, but this, this sounds pretty bad. What sort of odd drink is this going to be called? The corny banana. It actually is corny banana. I literally called it. I don't even know what to say. I feel like there's people People in this world who 100% order drinks like this. All right, let's increase our building. All that's happening is my building is changing its hairstyle. All right, Doc, what do you want? All right, so we got a cucumber into a pear. What happens if I give you one demonic ingredient? Like, they didn't give me a demonic pineapple or I totally would have done it. Like, does he only vomit slightly? Everyone's standards have completely vanished. I don't have to do anything perfectly anymore. Ooh, a new glass. Rose chocolate. This sounds both intriguing and awful. I don't know why, but I just got three perfects on this. Why did I try so hard? It is. It's just rose chocolate. Some of these names have a lot of thought put into them. Others is just people running out of time and energy. All right, I'm going to get a mega spin soon. What do you want? He wants coffee in a cloud. You're getting a pink mug because it's awesome. You can have this cloud though. Oh. Oh, I'm trying, guys. Oh. oh, oh, the milk keeps flying. It has a mind of its own. Someone kill the milk. It's so hard to write a yeet. My cloud is urinating. How do you feel about my urinating cloud? He's only half a fan. This guy only wants hot dogs in his shake. That's it. It's just a meat shake. Sausage shake. Whatever, I'm gonna give you this so there's a little bit of fruit in this. Now get out of my business and don't ever come back. Don't drink your sausage in front of me. And the time has come for the big spin. Come on, toilet paper. You're literally the end boss. You're the only thing I want in life. Okay, I'll take three free spins. Toilet paper, no. Toilet paper, yes! <laughs> Oh, and this random icicle. Tell me that you want me to blend up toilet paper for you. Ah! Oh. What if I give him a normal piece of fruit? It's too fresh. Does, wait, does he vomit? I didn't think about that. Right, what happens when he drinks it? Is his head gonna explode? Oh, he's still happy. He drank it anyway. In fact, he wants another one. Huh, lemon and pineapple. That feels very, very citrusy. I like it. What are you? It's a Yeti. Do Yetis eat toilet paper? I don't know. I never really thought about it. Okay, we have an entire cob of corn, followed by one of these, followed by a lemon. This is a very varied drink here. It's also called the Fresh and Bitter. This drink got that title after the divorce. Here you go. I got a new hand. It's the horrible hand. It's actually kind of concerning. The fingers are so long. I think I'm just gonna keep the hand I have. Wait, if the fact that these fingers are so long, does that just mean that you can cut more of your fingers off more quickly? You know what, now I wanna know. Yes, finally, icicles. Hold on. Ah! Sorry, she's new to the team. I had to do that to her. Everyone has to get their fingers removed at least once on the job. All right, I got an ice cream and here it is. An entire roll of toilet paper. <laughs> I just thought about this, but why do Yetis drink toilet paper? It's called a frozen white. Well, congratulations. Now you can drink it, vomit, and then wipe. Yummy. Not juice, again. That, In fact, that is the entire thing this game has taught me. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Blend It 3D. Until next time, stay foxy, much love.